Plans to ban single-use plastic plates, cutlery and polystyrene cups in England have just been announced as part of proposals to tackle what ministers say is the unnecessary use of plastics that wreak havoc with our natural environment. The measures will be considered in a public consultation this autumn, with Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland having similar plans. Here's our political correspondent, Nick Hurdley. This is our bamboo lunch set. Is this the future uh, of eating on the go? Paris sells bamboo cutlery across the UK. We start working with bamboo and hemp. Sustainable items which he hopes are part of the answer to reducing plastic consumption. What do you think about the idea of banning plastic cutlery? Yep, I will vote uh, for anybody who will ban it. I think plastic is everywhere. Look, we cannot get rid of plastic completely, but there is definitely certain areas where we can improve. This is the problem, plastic in oceans around the world, deadly for a number of species. Campaigners have been urging the government to act. The reality is that you know we are really facing an environmental crisis. Our oceans are full of plastic. Um, they're, they're killing marine life and they're damaging our ecosystem. Banning these items is going to contribute to, to stopping plastic pollution. We need the government to go much, much, much further. We're facing a plastics crisis and we need to turn off the tap. And this is what ministers want to ban. Single-use plastic cutlery and plates. It's all part of a strategy from the government to try and get rid of what it calls avoidable plastic waste by 2042. But so far anyway, there's no mention of things like this, plastic coffee cups, and some want ministers to go further. There will now be a consultation, but it could be another 18 months before a ban becomes law. Friends of the Earth say faster, more radical action is needed. We need government to take an overall approach to say that what we're going to do is bring an end to all plastic pollution and what we're going to do is drastically reduce the amount of all single-use products, not just a fork followed by a spoon followed by a cup. We're trying to be sustainable. Paris hopes increased awareness and reduced cost so will make alternatives our, uh, to plastic more popular. If we came to your house for dinner, we'd all be eaten with bamboo cutlery. I will give you bamboo cutlery, no plastic in my house. <laughs> Nick Early, BBC News.